Hello again guys, getting a ridiculously late start to the day. Ended up spending the grand majority of the day working on day job stuff, as well as a little bit of work on video stuff. I had some unboxing stuff that I got really far behind on. So I've got a video that's actually uploading right now. It should be going live shortly. It's about the Duino Kit Junior. Something I've actually had sitting around for a little while that I just haven't gotten around to unboxing, but I'm really excited. Once I can get my son to start learning a little more about electronics, this will be something we can actually do together. Definitely ought to check out that video. But, uh, then I spent uh, some of the afternoon, it was a very, very weird situation. Normally I prefer to kind of do things for myself, but over the last couple of years I've started kind of letting a lot of that go. So, we've actually got a guy that mows our lawn for us because it just, you know, my allergies and everything, I'm allergic to grass, I'm allergic to dust, and pretty much all of the outdoors. It's very convenient to be able to pay somebody reasonably low price to mow all of our lawn for us. And then, since my wife is pregnant and is not supposed to be doing as much work, I do a little bit of work around the house. I try to help out as much as I can. But, once every few weeks, we have a lady and her husband come and they help clean up the house and everything. So that's definitely very nice. And they were here today, so I was kind of working around them and, and helping them around to, you know, to see what needed to be cleaned and lifting things up and moving things around. So, it was, a, it was an odd situation because at one time we had three people that were doing things for us here. Just a little bit odd for me. But anyway, video is almost done uploading. I'm, as you can see, I'm out in the garage. I'm getting ready to take Duncan to soccer practice. So we made it to Duncan's soccer practice, plenty of time to spare. And uh, I went ahead and dropped Christina and Duncan off. And I've actually got to run over to Best Buy because I have to take this little thing back. This is, it's a universal travel power adapter thing. I probably ought to hang on to it because it's probably useful, but I paid like 20 bucks for it at Best Buy and I guarantee you it's cheaper on Amazon. So I'm, I'm going to go ahead and take this one back. I took it because I figured I might need it in China and as I expected the, the plugs in China were definitely compatible. So I'm guessing the hotel was, was the one that was compatible and not complaining about that in the slightest. So quick trip to Best Buy, I'm going to pick up some dinner for the family and then back to soccer practice. Well, that was reasonably painless. Uh, just went in there. She said, is there anything wrong with it? I said, no, I actually never even tried it, so I don't know. I bought it for a trip to China, ended up not needing it. She said, yeah, that, you know, better safe than sorry. No harm done, no problem. So there's 20 bucks back on my card. Cool story. I brought the ZUKZ1 out here with me today. I'm trying to capture a little bit of pictures and video with it of the, the soccer that we're watching. Alrighty, well we are back home and everything is getting settled down for the night. Duncan and Christina have already gone to bed. I'm gonna get to work on some more video related stuff. Uh, I ended up, uh, I did the Duino Kit Jr. unboxing video, got that all edited and uploaded earlier, and the initial video responses so far have not been great. A lot of people saying that it's just very expensive. I definitely understand that. I can get that. Uh, however, I took this all out, I showed it to Duncan this evening when we got home, showed him all the, the emissions that come inside of it and everything, told him about some of the things we can do with it. There's even, like, you can build a little Simon game out of it. If you're not familiar with that, it's, uh, it's a little round toy that has four different lights and buttons on it, and you push those in certain sequence, and then the next person has to follow that sequence. Very fun little game for kids, and Duncan loves that game. So that may be something that we do together. It may actually turn into a video. If I can get him to start playing with this thing and spark him into actually doing these sorts of electronics puzzles with me, that would be excellent because when I was five, he's six, when I was five, I was taking things apart. I was going to the house looking for things that I could take apart. My dad brought home our first computer when I was five, and the first thing I did to it, they put it in our bedroom, first thing I wanted to do was I wanted to take the case off of it and see how everything worked. So I was flipping switches on the, the inside, the dip switches, figuring out how they worked. The, you know, certain ones disabled one floppy drive, disabled the other drive, things like that. Overclocking, I don't know, whatever. It was way back in the day. This was like in 1987. My brother got a drum set for Christmas one year. What's the first thing I do? I wanted to take it apart. I got a Walkman. What's the the first thing I do with that Walkman, if you're not familiar with kids, is a it's a tape player. Again, probably way before most of your time. Anyway, first thing I did with that, I took it apart. I wanted to see how it worked. So this is something that I would love to get involved with with him and get him involved with because realistically up to this point it's either been sports or video games with him. So the more kinds of interest we can find to share, the better. Anyway, hope you guys are having a great day. I notice I'm back on the RX100 camera. The refund and everything process on the original RX100 Mark III, so I'm very happy about that. And the new RX100 Mark III should show up tomorrow. 
So hopefully things will continue to look like this and sound like this, but maybe be a little bit closer without having to be so close, I guess wider angle lens. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and finish this video up. I've actually got two videos I need to be working on for XDA, so I'm gonna get started on those as well. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you again tomorrow.